Hello, 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 and welcome back to my channel. My name is Alanda Madeline, and today I will be giving you a Dollar Tree haul. Um, I'm going to be starting with the beauty products. I do have several bags, so I'm going to try to make it quick and sweet. Okay, so these beauty products, um, I've started out with getting, um, it's a company that Dollar Tree carries now, Ioni. I think that's how you pronounce it there. Um... The eyelashes, I thought that was a pretty good buy, considering the length of the lashes. They're not just some little flimsy looking ones that you buy that cost a dollar. These are the ones that we get from like the beauty store that would be probably about five bucks. So I thought this was a steal. I don't think it's, um, I mean, it's false mink lashes. 100% handmade, but it's not 100% human. But I mean, you can't go wrong with getting these just for a night, you know, that you didn't get your lashes extended or, um, you know, just whatever. You'll have, like, you know, a box or two that you can just hurry up and uh, put them on. Then I said, well, let me try these because I never tried these before. And they're pretty long just in case, like, one day I have time to even do this because I used to wear this, um, I started out wearing lashes on individual, going to the nail shop, and then um, they was doing this. And some days I didn't have any money uh, or I just didn't have time. I would do it myself. So um, I thought that was a good steal. I just bought two of these. And um, I bought, I, I left a few for somebody to want to grab them, but I bought a lot of these. Okay, so um, as I was going, I noticed like, oh my God, they got more Ioni um, products. So um. Right here is a face hydrating primer. I already um, tried this out. I just wanted to see how it was. Um, and it comes in this little pink tube. I thought this was really good to um, actually get. And I don't have any foundation or anything on today. And I just put this amount on. I don't know if you can see that. And rub it together. And it makes... My face feels so good. Oh my god, it really did. It's, I mean, it's so. It, it's not like, you know how like you buy like some kind of cheap oil and you um, you know, it dries. It goes on smooth and then it dries rough. This is still smooth and it does its job before you apply your makeup. So, I thought this was a good steal. I bought two of these. And this is the face finishing spray here. And it comes in a purple tube. I don't know if you can see this or not. So, I thought this was really nice. It just have the brand on there. The top of the spray, you know, after you apply your makeup. I don't have any makeup on today. So, but... Cool for $1.25. <laughs> okay, so I showed you those lashes. Um, I did run across some lashes that I probably wouldn't wear, but um, it say be mine on there. And I was thinking about putting them in gift baskets that I'm going to be doing for Valentine's Day. So I just grabbed a couple of those. And um, I see here um, it's a matte lipstick and it's the color peach buff. So um, I might be too I might be too dark for this. I'm not sure, but I do a lot of lip glosses, so I figure um, you know if this can put a little tint to my lips or whatever and whatever. I just wanted to see how the texture of this matte was and maybe if I can find a color I will be probably comfortable with. I know that. This is a good lipstick. Okay. Um, this is another Prime Shield face primer. So, Millennia. I don't know how you pronounce that, but I never tried this one. So, I said I'll just see how that worked. Um, sometimes, if you can find things that's cheaper, shoot. Why spend your money? I, sp I spend high and I spend low. Whatever works or whatever I like. That's what I'm spending my money on. Okay, this is the same brand as this one. Um, I don't know what this is. Oh, Conceal and Perfect. Okay, correct. 
Conceal and Perfect. Okay, so these are the colors here. Um, I'm going to just try this out. I never tried this before. And this is another, this is the same brand. And this is um, medium to deep. So I'm thinking this is like some, okay, setting powder. So they got this. And it's my complexion. So, so I'm going to try this stuff, you know. I might make a tutorial of me using everything down to the lashes. Dollar Tree look, beauty look. <laughs> Loose eyeshadow, intense um, sh shimmer. So um, it comes with a brush as well. So um, I did get that. And uh, this is a, I say honeysuckle. I guess that's the kind it is. And I picked up some press ones which I thought they were really cute. I don't know why you seem like you can't be able to see it, but it has like some kind of gold uh, design on there. And each time that I pick up nails, I always um, buy two so I can fit my nails perfectly. Or if I lose one, break one, I have an extra one to replace. So that's that one. I have, this is like a marble, black and white and gray. And this is like a peachy pink, black and gray. And I've seen these, it's 60 pieces with different color nails. This blue, black, peach, purple, gray, and green. I like that. This is like a maroon, soft pink, blush pink, medium pink. Uh, maybe burgundy and white. See that? This is like an animal print. Black, tan, and red. I do these for Valentine's Day. <laughs> and these are tips. And they're 100 piece nails. Short. Um, I don't really do too many long nails in, um, at this time anyway. I'm more comfortable with wearing shorter nails because I braid my baby hair and I my profession is taking care of people. So I don't want to scratch anybody. I always like to keep some mild soap around for my boys. Or if I have company and, you know, can't go wrong with a mild soap, Jergens. And this here is like a lip oil. So I said I would try this. This seems to be pretty natural. So I said I'll try that. And is that all? Okay, so I'ma take this out and put everything else in the bag. And um, I don't play any games. When it's time for me to go to Dollar Tree, I don't go that often, but when I go, I go. Okay, so I have these little um, things for the boys, the little letters that they can do whatever they want, any kind of craft that they want to do with that. That was a dollar. Um, I bought this thing here. It's a um, like a phone thing. Sometimes, like, well, it's getting really close to Valentine's Day. So I like to like um, sometimes make like a, a dozen of strawberries and make them like um, roses. So I'll use a vase and put like cut the piece that I need and put it in a vase. So I like buying these and I use them for like flowers I create around the house as well. Um, okay. Like I said, Valentine's Day is next month and it's coming pretty soon. So they have a lot of cake toppers. So I bought uh, two of each of these cake toppers. Happy Valentine's Day with the little heart. You can also put that inside of a vase. It don't necessarily have to be on the dessert. I see love and this is gold like merit uh, material I guess. And um, this is the heart. So like I said, I got two of each. 
I may can use this when I um, do my Valentine's treat. I showed you these before already, so I'm not going to go into details with that. But of course, I stacked up on it. So, you know. Um, I seen some velvet ribbons, you know, just little Valentine's ribbons, and this is like a really, really, really soft material. Um, more ribbons for Valentine's Day, and this is like the glitter Tula. Julie, whatever you call this. Um, yeah, so you can make nice bowls with this as well. And some bacon cups. Okay. Just want to bake this stuff up so we can be out my way. And that's that. These are some wreaths that you can hang. Actually, the pieces here that you can hang. So what my idea was, um, I bought enough little pieces and I might just go back and buy more because I love decorating this dining room. As you can see, I still have my tree up, guys. I know, I still have my tree up. But um, yes, this here is... Um, Something that I can be able to do. Um, hang on my door. I was thinking about connecting it like this. Excuse me, guys, if you hear my kids in the background. And, you know, connecting it like that so it can be three to hang on my front door. I thought that would be nice. It's a pretty nice material. It's like plasticky, but it's really pretty. Um, I love decorating. So, yep, yeah, I'll hang them on the front door. And I will get this for my back door. Just hang it, you know, like that. I thought that was pretty. Like I said, I might go back and get more because I know I want to decorate in the inside of the house as well. And look at this. This is really pretty. I was thinking about putting this in here um, because I have my well, dining room. It has this color in here. So... I don't know where I'm gonna put it, but I thought this was cute. Plus, I can also use this when I decorate my bathroom because I have curtains and rugs and um, you know bath mats and stuff that matches this. So I thought that was really cute. Uh, wherever I'm gonna decorate this set, this is gonna go with it because it matches. And this is like one of those, you know, um, what you call these things, garlands. So yeah. But that was really pretty and um, this too heart picks so I can, I can do a lot of little festivities with this let me settle my kids so I'll be right back I'm back guys sorry about that it was getting too loud for me okay so, I bought more garland. These are, it's two of them. It's like they're connected. So, what did I do? So, I must have bought two of the pink ones. And that's what I did. I bought one red. So, I'll probably hang this on my banister. And I bought another pink. So, I'm going to decorate this dining room in here with that. I can just picture it right now. Yes. I see it. Do you see it? Okay. So that's that out there for me. And let's see. Okay. Let's do 
this big here. I bought some flowers. I just randomly buy little flowers because um, I switch my bathroom up a lot. And I'm really thinking that I have some um, bathroom rugs that goes with these flowers. And I really think that these are so pretty. I have like a vase that I switch up when I um, change my bathroom every month. And I use like different colors. So I said, well, this can be added to my collection. And uh, I bought this checkerboard paper straws. They're really awesome. So I bought these. They come 18 in a pack. So I thought they were nice. Parchment paper. Parchment paper. I love them. Parchment paper for bacon and, and things like that. More glitter tooling for like ribbons for Valentine's Day. I buy these for all types of crafts, even making my bling sticks for my candy apples. So I must have bought two each. And I bought more baking cups. I can put strawberries inside or cupcakes. I always pick these up because I can't go wrong with these. It saves me doing a lot of dishes. So I'll pick those up. This is another um, cake topper. Um, these are all, oh no, this is the same one. These are things here that I can make that also go with the strawberries or what kind of basket I make um, with the treats. The heart little blings. I thought they were cute. They blow up like a heart. This is the pink color. So I showed you a white color. This is the red color. And this is the pink color. And these are all folks. So I love buying this stuff because, you know, it saves you time. You can just toss it right in the trash once you're done. I'm trying to hurry up. I don't want it to be a very long, drawn out video, guys. But I'm just excited. I love Dollar Tree. So, I mean, you can't beat it. Even though they put 25 cent more onto the dollar. Hubby swipes. My baby boy is in training for um potty. So I buy these for him. I bought four of them. And I think it doesn't say okay, it's 24 wipes in each pack. And I pretty much like that because you know. Once you rip that piece off, you can close it and keep your wipes nice and moisturized. So I bought four packs of those. Uh, 500 milligram Tylenols. You can tell I was in each aisle today, wasn't I? <laughs> Two boxes of those. And um, 13 gallon trash bags for my can in my bedroom. I think that's the only can these fit. And I always tend to buy two boxes because they only come with 12. So, I buy two of those. And I believe it's one more bag. Okay, guys. Now, before I dig into this, I'm going to just tell you. I really like the chicken teriyaki. I mean, the beef teriyaki noodles. But I will settle for the chicken as long as teriyaki. They pretty good, but they not better than the beef. No debate, no debate. That's just my opinion. But yes, uh, I when I buy these, I buy these maybe six to eight of them because they're good. And sometimes it's really good and very convenient um, for lunch. If you want to, you know, just put water in it and heat it right up in the microwave. And sometimes if I even eat this for dinner, sometimes I'll... Um, Make me some shrimp to put inside. Cut up some iron, you know. That's dinner right there. So I love these, but I usually get them in beef. But they didn't have them today, so I didn't just want to leave out without them. So. And last but not least, these little um, grain bars, breakfast bars, whatever you want to call them. Um, the kids sometimes like to grab one of these in the morning before they go off to school. 
I let them try to eat breakfast. They get there on time to eat, but sometimes they could just grab like a piece of fruit or, you know, something. I don't like them to leave out without eating anything. So that is all that I have today, guys. Um, for my dollar haul. Thank you so much for stopping by my page. Please like, share, uh, subscribe to my channel so when I make the videos, you will get a notification to let you know that I'm on. Thank you and you have an awesome day and thanks for coming by. See ya.